This video will show you how to create a roll book using your roster from the Faculty Center. The first thing you have to do is sign into Prompt and go to your Faculty Center. You can do this through Employee Self Service. Click on My Faculty Center. This will show you a list of whatever classes you're teaching this semester. Go to the class for which you want to make the roll book and click on the class roster icon. This pulls up the class roster for that class. To download this roster, click on this little box here in the blue toolbar. Click on that. You should get this dialog box that offers to open this file. If you have pop-ups disabled, in your web browser, you might have to enable pop-ups to get this message. So make sure, if you don't get this pop-up, check and make sure if you don't have a bar up here that says you need to enable pop-ups. Click on OK. When you open the file in Excel, you're probably going to get this error message. Click Yes and you have now opened your roster. So next I'm going to show you first of all how to clear contents in a column and then I'm going to show you how to add columns. So you may have some columns here that you don't actually need. If that is the case you can take your mouse pointer and right click at the top of each column and you can clear the contents. That means that the column is still there, you simply remove the contents. So for example, if you don't need this, make sure your column is selected when you before you can clear contents. I don't need the add date, so I'm going to clear contents. I don't really need the level, so I'm going to clear the contents. So now let's say I still need more columns. I can right click in the last column and insert rows like that. So I could just go insert column. Notice if I select the column and then click insert it just automatically creates a new column so I'm just gonna do that a few more times. Now in order to identify these columns you'll have to create headings. So for example I could click here and this might be the column where I record the grade for the first quiz in the class. I might want a column for homework assignments. If you need to adjust the width of a column, you can just get right up in between the columns and simply slide it over to make the column wider. So in this way you can add as many columns as you need and um, so you can keep track of all assignments. You can add a column for uh, your attendance if you want to do that. So at the end of the semester when you're all done with this you can submit your roll book online by simply using the email address rollbooks at peralta.edu